Tens of thousands of protesters in Bangkok are calling for government reform. The demonstrations are happening in defiance of a new ban on gatherings. Jonathan Head from our partners at BBC News reports. All public gatherings are now banned, said the government. Plenty of young Thais were prepared to come out and challenge that here in Bangkok's downtown. Free our friends, they shouted, reacting to the news that the most high-profile leaders of the protest movement, which has shaken up this country with its radical demands for reform of the monarchy, were arrested and taken out of the city in what looks like a concerted effort to shut the movement down. As their numbers built, they pushed forward against lines of police who seemed unsure how tough they could be with this youthful crowd. With one surge, they occupied the entire intersection. At this point, the police were pushed back against the railings, leaping over to escape the pressure, even thanking some protesters who'd helped them. This first day of the protest ban was not going well for the authorities. One of the few leaders to escape arrest, Mike Rayon, then led the crowd in a chant of, we're not afraid. Like a lot of people here, he believes what happens next largely depends on the king. Do you think the king is listening to you? I cannot answer that easily. We would like His Majesty to adjust himself. We don't want to overthrow his institution, but in the future, we want the monarchy to live in harmony with the people. What has been said by this movement cannot now be unsaid. The comments they've made about the monarchy, the demands that the king, as well as other parts of the government, must be accountable to the people, must be accountable to elected authority. Those demands are out there, and surprising numbers of Thais are now saying they agree with them. How is the government going to get this sentiment back into the bottle when they're suffering from a COVID-19 driven economic crisis and indeed a crisis of legitimacy? By the day's end, the earlier stern commands of the government had crumpled into a messy scrum, a stalemate. Past experience teaches us that the authorities will get the upper hand for now. But time, youth and passion are on the side of those seeking to transform this country. Jonathan Head, BBC News, Bangkok.